The coral triangle is the world's centre of marine life. Due to its species richness, it is also known as the nursery of the seas. The coral triangle is home to 75% of all coral species on the planet. More than 3,000 species of fish, marine mammals, including whales and dolphins, and six of the world's seven species of marine turtles, such as the leatherback, hawksbill and green turtle. The coral triangle covers all or part of the seas of six countries in the Indo-Pacific region, Indonesia, Malaysia, Papua New Guinea, the Philippines, Solomon Islands and Timor Leste. As a centre of marine life, it also directly supports more than 120 million people living in the region who depend upon its resources. Sea turtles are reptiles. They mainly live in tropical waters and spend more time in the water than on land. They can swim distances of thousands of kilometres and still, they are able to return to the beach where they were born. There, the females lay their eggs in the sand, up to a hundred at a time. The warmth of the sun hatches the eggs. Of every 1,000 turtle hatchlings, only a few reach mature age. Sea turtles are in danger. People eat their eggs and trade their meat. Tourists disturb their nestling beaches and fishing nets trap them. Where tourists crowd on beaches, there is no safe place for nestling anymore. That's why WWF establishes marine protected areas. Working with the local people, WWF takes the eggs to a place where they can hatch in peace. WWF has been successful in Berau to the turtle habitat by the establishment of a marine protected area, 1.2 million hectares, the largest one in Indonesia so far. WWF donated two glass bottom boats to the local community to use for tourism and patrolling. The beautiful shell of the hawksbill turtle is still being used for souvenirs, despite the long-standing ban on its international trade. And Bali used to be home to a lively trade in green turtle meat and eggs. In Bali, the turtle trade drops 90% in the last three years by increasing the awareness of turtle conservation. WWF helped facilitate the creation of Turtle Conservation and Education Centre, which is involved conservation education, creation alternative livelihood for former poachers and local people, as well as acting as rehabilitation centre and hatchery. But a lot still needs to be done. In the Coral Triangle, every year 5,000 turtles still die as bycatch from the fishing industry, meaning they are accidentally caught. Many more marine protected areas are needed to increase the chances of survival for these young sea turtles. <laughs> <laughs> 